tech giants have suspended processing government requests for user data in Hong Kong. 刚办国安法生效后 ，Google、Facebook 等科技巨头表明拒绝交出用户个资，维护言论自由。Meanwhile, Chinese app TikTok has also said that it will stop operations in Hong Kong in the coming days. 抖音国际版 TikTok 也决定撤出香港市场。TikTok 发言人指出，在港版国安法下，在港企业可能被要求向中共提供用户个资或审查内容，而母公司字节跳动科技因而无法拒绝中共当局的要求。近来 TikTok 敏感的中资背景已经接连引发各国政府的不安疑虑。The government of India has issued an interim order for the blocking of 59 apps, including TikTok. 继印度以资安国安疑虑宣布禁用 TikTok 等多款中国手机应用程式后，澳洲与美国也准备推动禁用令。We're taking this very seriously. We're, we're, we're certainly looking at it. We've worked on this very issue for a long time. We declared ZTE a danger to American national security. We've done all of these things with respect to Chinese apps on people's cell phones. I can assure you, the United States will get this one right too. Would you recommend that people download that app on their phones、uh, tonight, tomorrow, anytime、uh, currently? Only if you want your private information in the hands of the Chinese Communist Party. 即使 TikTok 先前澄清，中共从来没有要求他们提供用户数据，用户数据也没有储存在中国。但是，中共透过中国公司盗取资讯的黑历史，加上 TikTok 先前爆发的内容审查争议，不免让人心生疑虑。新唐人演的电视赵廷玉，台湾台北采访报道。